Shooter, are you ready? Stand by. It's about power and precision. And Amanda Furr is dialed in. One of the best there is. The 21-year-old sure shot definitely feels at home on the range. Or we come down here and shoot his family. I called the... But it's at her parents' Spokane home where Amanda first fell in love with shooting. This is one of the first guns that I ever shot with. Early on, she had her sights set on becoming a soccer star. Initially, her interest in guns didn't extend much past this Halloween costume. And I decided I was going to be Calamity Jane, you know, a, um, a famous, like, shooter and in 2007 I went to the Pan American Games and these big cups are from the Czech Republic. Today the fame is obviously coming along just fine. The first Spokane home is adorned with hundreds of Amanda shooting awards. The biggest came earlier this month when Amanda earned a coveted spot on the US Olympic team shooting this 22 caliber rifle. It's the gun that I shot in my first junior Olympic championships. And you may have noticed this other gun, a pink pistol. Fitting for someone who describes herself as a girl of God, guns, and glitter. You know, I have a lot of faith in God, and, you know, I'm always around guns shooting, and um, it's a huge part of my life, obviously. And I'm a girly girl, I, I really am. I love high heels and um, doing my hair and <laughs> shopping, you know, the whole bit. But now she has a laser focus on London. Dump your magazine. Uh -huh. With your pointed down. Amanda's dad, Mike, who's been coaching her from the beginning, was all nerves at the Olympic trials. I just stay out back tying uh, mountain climbing knots. Because you're nervous? Oh, I'm very much nervous. But Amanda found herself in a knot of her own, falling behind at the trials. And I thought that I was out of it. Fighting back tears, she did what she always does. I went and found my dad because uh, I always talk to him whenever I'm having problems. That's, that's, uh, that was an amazingly tough period. My dad uh, reassured uh, my confidence and my skills. You're the champion. You can do this. We never quit. I went in there and decided I just wasn't going to give up. She went in and won the match. All the things that happened between, you know, when I was 11 and now, it's like <laughs> unreal. And Amanda was... Especially uh, when you consider how far she's feet. come. And her first shot was this one. Completely missed the target. Amanda's very first shot still documented in the family's garage door. And her second shot was this one. And then I thought maybe some a little more training was in order. So we uh, we uh, uh, we pulled her off the gun. Oh, he showed that to you. <laughs> it's the kind of thing you learn on a trip home with an Olympian. After this brief break, Amanda returns to that intense training and focus. And she hopes it'll bring her the best glitter of all. I visualize a medal and me standing on a podium. And um, that's the vision for everybody. But, you know, for somebody, it's got to come true. So maybe it'll be me.